long time no speak welcome to a brand new video and hello to all of you lovely lot it's been a while i haven't made a youtube video in i think about three or four weeks it could be longer truth be told i ran out of ideas and i didn't really have enough time in between doing like stuff for my instagram and my part-time job so yes Sorry I've been absent so, so long but I'm back at it today with a big haul because I know you all love those and it's from not one, not two but three different brands so I've got a big Primark bag here, note the Christmas bags, yes it's December now, I think the last time I uploaded a video was in September so October's passed, Halloween's passed, and now we're at full into Christmas mode. I've got a big new look parcel that I've just picked up from my local one, and I've got three bits that I've ordered from ASOS. I did have a bigger ASOS order, and if you follow me on Instagram, you're probably expecting a big ASOS order um, haul through this video as well but truth be told I sent most of it back because all of the dresses I ordered were either too short unflattering and were too big for me or I just didn't like them so I thought there's no point in me doing a haul of things that I don't like so I'm going to show you the few bits that I did keep from the order but the main bulk of this haul will be Primark and New Look which I haven't actually shopped New Look for so long I think the last time I ordered something online was like in July so it's been quite a long time since I've done a proper look on new look so everything will be linked in the description below if i can obviously with primark stuff i can't but if i see anything similar on other places i'll link that as well but um if you aren't subscribed already please make sure you hit that subscribe button and notification bell so you don't miss any new videos from me i'm hoping to do a few more like festive videos me and my boyfriend are going to london um, in a few weeks for a few, few nights so I'm hoping to show you like some festive bits of London and stuff and um, we're doing something very exciting in London as well so yeah be sure to join us for that and hit the notification bell so you don't miss any of the uploads but without further ado let's get on into this big haul which one should we do first? I'm going to do the ASOS bits first because that is the smallest bit and two items are ones that I'm wearing at the moment but I am going to do a try on haul of all of this I'll probably be re regretting saying this after trying everything on but I've got to try it on at some point to see if it looks right so might as well do it and include them in the video at, um, at the same time so the first item is this top and this top that I got on ASOS but they're actually from Monkey. I really rate Monkey for their like um, basic t-shirts like this. I haven't really got a long sleeved white basic t-shirt which I think is quite a good thing to have especially in the winter just to layer. I've just got a vest under this because it is a bit cold but it's just a nice thing to wear rather than just like a short sleeve t-shirt because it just gives you that a little bit of extra warmth and this actually came in the two pack with the striped t-shirt which is what I wanted to begin with because I've had the same H&M black and white striped t-shirt probably for the, about the last three years it's done me really good but it is starting to get a little bit like tatty and old now so I thought I'd treat myself to a new one and this is a really nice like boxy fit you'll be able to see on the try on clip how it fits but like I've just got this tucked into the front of um, some trousers and I just really like it and they're super soft um, I think it was £20 for two but I did get um, some like discount off because I found a discount code but yeah really like these really simple and I think it's quite cool that they've done like a two pack of them because I wouldn't have necessarily brought a white one um like just because but um because it came in the two pack of it I've actually found myself reaching for it a little bit more which is good and then the second item are actually some trousers that I'm wearing which I'll try and show you like the print of so they are these like gingham check print flares and I've never been one to kind of wear flares i didn't think they were really suitable for like kind of my body shape or i just didn't feel ever comfortable wearing them 
but oh my god these are the most comfortable trousers i have ever worn they feel like i'm wearing pajama bottoms or like jogging bottoms but smart like smarter wear ones and they've got kind of like a bell kind of bottom on them so they're kind of like a, a 70s flare but i'll show you a better like video and picture on screen of them on but oh my god i love them to the point that I've now brought two more pairs of flares because I love them so much and both of them are going to be in this haul so make sure you are continue watching to see what I am what, which ones I picked up but I believe these were 19.99. I got these in a size 18 and they are perfect they're super stretchy but they don't feel like they're too tight like on my belly or my like legs so highly recommend these and if you haven't ever tried flares before and you're a similar size to me definitely recommend picking some up just to see if you fit, think they're like comfy and they look good because I can guarantee you'll be proven wrong just like I am because I just absolutely love them oh and I forgot to say these tops I got in an extra large I know monkey can be a little bit funny for like sizes especially for like 18 and 20s but an extra large I find it's fine it's like it's the perfect oversized fit but if you want to kind of get a more of a tighter fit I would recommend going for a large because I still feel like you're going to get a little bit of an oversized look about it but it will still be nice so shall we go for Primark next and I will warn you there are a few Christmas items in here because there was Christmas stuff out in my local one today and to be honest I couldn't resist to be honest well, I just said to be honest twice, but yes, this is the first item. I'm just gonna move the bag out of the way. It is the most cutest green, red, and white festive moment that you will see me wearing throughout December. Because how can I not? This was ten pounds. Can you believe it? What a bargain! And it was an extra large, and it's like the perfect, like tight fit. It's like a really um. It's quite thick for £10, like a nip, and I just love it. It's got like a little collar and button-up moment there, and I just love it. Imagine this with like a little black mini skirt with like a slit up the leg, and some Doc Martens, and like a massive like fluffy coat, going to like a Christmas market, or going for like a little festive walk. Oh, I just love it. It's so cool definitely recommend picking this up they still had some of these in my local Primark today but I did get this in Norwich a few weeks ago so if you do like it I would recommend going to your local Primark quickly to get this because I know this is just going to be such a fan favourite of Primarks to pick up because it's like it's a Christmas jumper but it's not like a really tacky in your face Christmas jumper so you could wear this every day truth be told i saw someone when we went out a few weeks ago wearing it as just a normal jumper i'm like it's red green and white it's obviously a christmas jumper i wouldn't wear that normally in october really like i mean all the power to her but i definitely wouldn't be wearing it outside of like late november early december but each to their own so on the topic of Christmas jumpers, shall we just get the Christmas things out of the way? I feel like that's going to be the easiest thing to do and everything's now falling over. So the next one is my, probably my Christmas jumper for this year. I always have to get a new like in your face Christmas jumper every year. It's my collection of Christmas jumpers is honestly getting bigger and bigger. I might have to do like a colour of them. I did do like a whole week last year on my Instagram where I styled up loads of my um, different Christmas jumpers so maybe I'll like do a reel of it this year. But you know, I had to go for the Disney one. This was actually quite spendy for Primark. It was £16 but it is really good quality and I got this in an extra large and I just loved it. It was so cute. It's not too in your face. I quite like the like um, cream um version of this and then kind of like the motif does all of the um like talking for you but there's even like a little fluffy trim to his hat but it's just so cute and i feel like this is a bit of an easier thing to wear like if you wanted to wear it to work or if you wanted to wear it like out for the day 
but um, I got something to go with this because I've got something planned for the jumper and the outfit that I'm planning to wear this with so let me just get that out next and to be honest I wouldn't have necessarily picked this up had I not been like looking for it but I just couldn't resist like shimmer just screams Christmas like the festive period it's just nice to have something that you can wear to like a nice Christmas dinner or party and I just absolutely love this it's a pleated midi skirt I believe this was 15 pounds yes and it was a size 18 and it's like got a stretchy waist so it's going to be perfect if you're going out for Christmas dinner you can even wear this on Christmas day because it would be quite a nice thing to just chuck on with like a little festive t-shirt or a jumper and then like lounge around the house in or if you get a little bit more dressed up on Christmas day it would be quite nice but I just love kind of how it's like shimmery and it's like festive but it's not too in your face like it's not sequins so it's not going to be like too itchy or uncomfortable to wear and I just love this I think I might be I'm um, taking this to London with us because I feel like this is going to be nice to wear in the evenings with some like heeled boots or something some tights and like a fluffy jacket but yeah just absolutely love that and it's really different and it's not something that I thought Primark would be selling this year but if you're in the like market for Christmas christmas party outfits i definitely recommend going to primark because there were some dresses there were some like really cool trousers and skirts I definitely recommend getting those so on the topic of dresses i have been on the hunt for a knitted black midi dress since i sold one that i had last year and that's always the case isn't it whenever you want to have something you either had it in your collection already and sold it or you can't find something in your size but I did order one from ASOS actually but I had to return it because it was £28 and this was 15 and it was really itchy I don't know what material it had been made out of but it was not a very comfortable material at all to wear and I could just sense the minute I um, put it on that I'd just get irritated with it so I was like no nope, not doing this and then I went into Primark and saw this one which is perfect so it's got kind of like a square neck detail you'll be able to see better when I um, try it on and do the try on clip but it will probably be here right now but I really like this it's like a really tight fit but I feel like this is going to be quite nice to like layer with like putting Doc Martens on it putting like a shacket over it and like really layering it and I think it's got a split on one side yeah it's got a split on this side is it yeah it's just one side so I just thought that was nice and it's long sleeved it's not too tight on the arms it's kind of got like a puff sleeve but I thought this would be perfect to just like chuck on one day if it's a little bit cold I might take this to London with me because again it's a really easy thing to put on but it looks like you made a little bit more of an effort so that's perfect and I got that in an extra large too and it looks like it's going to be like the perfect fit for me so yeah, and then the last thing that I got from Primark, I told you there was two more pairs of flares in this haul and truth be told, I got this pair of leopard print ones for £8, can you believe? What a bargain. These are a lot thinner than the ones that I got from New Look um, on ASOS, but I still love these. I haven't tried them on yet, but I'm hoping they fit. I got these in an extra large which um and they are quite stretchy as well but i just thought these would be a cool thing to wear like instead of a midi skirt because i love um pairing like leopard print with some of my band tees so i thought that would look quite cool um to keep me a little bit warmer in the winter and they've also got like kind of the flared bottoms like the bell bell bottoms which is something that my mum makes fun of that that bell bottoms are a thing still um, but yeah, I thought they, they were a little bit different and um, they're a little bit more comfy to wear than like jeans and tights sometimes and they're just an easy thing to chuck on. Even if you're lounging around the house, they'd be easy to wear. But yeah, absolutely love these and for £8 you can't complain, can you? 
So let's get into this big noodle parcel. Literally, you are getting my live reaction to this parcel because I've literally just picked it up and I'm filming a video the afternoon of picking it up. So let's dive in. Like I said, it's been such a long time. Well, for me, it has that I've since I've ordered stuff from New Look, so it was quite exciting to see all of these like new bits on. Um, the website that I obviously haven't um, seen because it's completely changed season so there was like loads of knitwear loads of like cool um, trousers and dresses so it's quite nice to see loads of fresh bits because if you're going online a lot shopping a lot you kind of see a lot of the same things so it was nice to kind of have completely new bits to look at so the first item I've pulled out is a curved screen floral creek i think this is a dress i ordered five dresses and some flares and something else i think i can't honestly remember even though it was only a few days ago but let's have a look at the first one like i said these are all going to be um try on clips as well because i need to try them on any oh i remember which one this is uh yeah because i need to try them on anyway so i might as well show you but it might just be on my phone as opposed to like using this but you'll forgive me so the first one is this really cute curves dress that i got in size 20 and it's got a really cute like lace detailing around the edge of the like v-neck on it which i quite like it's a nice length it kind of like goes out a little bit at the bottom but I actually quite like this and it's a really pretty colour, perfect for like autumn. You could um, style this with like a little vest underneath or even a, like a roll neck um, underneath to like layer it up to make it even better. But this would look really cute with some tights and some like chunky boots. And again, might be something I take to London with me. I did mainly get a lot of the dresses for work because i found myself like kind of reaching for the same dresses over and over again so i kind of wanted just some new ones to wear and um, i work on a reception desk so kind of have to dress semi nice semi like formal so i don't don't want to be looking tatty all the time but yeah that's the first dress i don't know how much all of them were because some of them were in the sale and i got some um for a discount but i will link everything below if you fancy anything um that will be all linked below if they're still available because i know a few of the dresses are in the sale and i think someone messaged me on instagram to say they're out of stock so i do apologize but if i can i will link it down below so the next one is the curves burgundy spot frill dress and this i believe has a cot like a peter pan collar i've seen a lot of people on instagram kind of like styling the collared dresses up and I just wanted to try it. I ordered one on ASOS but and I loved it but it was too short like to the point that even with tights I couldn't have really got away with it which is disappointing but hopefully this one will be a little bit different. Oh it's a bit of a different material than I thought it was going to be. It's a lot thinner so I will definitely be wearing a vest underneath it but this is it i absolutely love burgundy especially for like winter time i just think it's such a rich gorgeous color to kind of um style with but you can see the like cute little collar i thought it was just a little bit of a different style for me to try and it does look a little bit short for curves i got this in a size 20 again i think i got everything in the size 20 because i never really know sometimes with new look um whether things are going to be a bit tighter or not but um it's i think that's like full length sleeves got kind of like a little um elasticated one which i quite like on the sleeves because then it stops it kind of from like um pushing up but yeah quite like that be good for work definitely and yeah it's just got um almost like pinky white polka dots on it that's quite cute hopefully it will be more of a success than my asos order i haven't ordered from asos in a long time and i think the like vibe from the order that i got suggests that i probably won't be ordering from them um for the next few months 
so the next one is a curves black ditzy floral dress can you tell i kind of go for polka dots or florals just an easy print to so this is like a cotton print i got this in a size 20 again from the curves range i actually really like this this is such an easy dress to kind of put on it's like a, more of like a smock dress i'd say uh, it's got like button details down the front but yeah this will be definitely very easy to wear it's like a nice print i thought it was black but it looks more like a navy blue with um kind of orangey ones so a little bit different but i like the print easy style it's a yes from me but the truth is in when they'll try them on if they're too short which is normally my issue and are they too tight around my boobs <laughs> to be honest with you so the next item oh these are the other flares because the flares that i'm wearing at the moment they're from new look just from asos um but these flares i've seen a few people wear they're from the Anne marie collection i love so many pieces from that collection but these ones i could not resist so i got these in the 20 because they are from the tool section but oh my god how cool is that print i just love them these are a lot thinner than the other ones like these ones are more of like a creepy thicker material so they're a little bit warmer but i just love these ones they are so cool they're going to be look really cool with like doc martens and bands and converse and stuff i just love these and they're going to even be good when you're like going into spring when it's still a little bit chilly and you want something a little bit like um longer on your legs but um yeah absolutely love those i hope they fit i hope they look right i'm so happy right we are getting through it i think we've got two more dresses left oh maybe i yeah i think it was only the oh yeah it was um just five dresses and the flares i ordered so two more dresses to go i'm sorry maybe i had something else in my basket but i put it because it was i think this was just under 100 pounds all of these which i don't think is too bad for like five dresses really is it but the next one is two pink check puff sleeve dress i think this was the one that was out of stock because someone wanted to use one of my links on instagram for it but it was out of stock oh i like the um feel of this material it's quite nice it's like a crinkle cut oh the only thing i don't really like about this is the like high neck collar i have to see how much i feel like i'm being strangled but I quite like this. I don't have a lot of pink in my wardrobe. So I thought this would be a bit of a different thing to wear. Those look massive. But then my um, my arms can be quite, um, quite like fun to find. <laughs> um, yeah, so it's like a smock dress with like a tiered um, kind of element to it. And yeah quite nice quite different i think i got this in, yeah i got this in size 20 in the tool section so hopefully it'll be long enough but we never know what they deem as tall nowadays really because i'm kind of like an average height but it's my legs that are long so everything looks short on me so the last dress is from the tool section again and this is in a size 20 and it's a tall black floral frill that's like a tongue twist tongue twister isn't it and this is like a black and yellow from which is quite similar to the one that i ordered on asos it was too short for me just not with the collar hold on let me just put this on here so this is the last dress quite similar to the other one it's just like not got the crinkle kind of feel to it but i really like the print of this this will be quite easy to wear for work because I can literally just chuck it on with a little cardigan and be done with it. But it's kind of like got a frill kind of ruffle sleeve at the top detail. This is more like a three quarter length. But yeah, I really like this. Nice. I think that will be a success. Which is not good for my bank. But then it's good for my wardrobe because I've got lots of new dresses to wear for work. But yeah, 
that was the haul thank you so much for watching i'm sorry again it's been so long since i've uploaded on my channel but please make sure you subscribe new videos are coming your way they're going to be festive they're going to be more hauls and everything so yeah i hope you enjoyed this video thank you so much for watching and i shall see you next time bye